I'm going to read today from the message and from the message what this has to share. And at the very end, we're going to come back because I'm going to share something with you that you may not have known. The accumulated sorrows of your exile will dissipate. I, your God, will get rid of them for you. You've carried those burdens long enough. At the same time, I'll get rid of all those who've made your life miserable. I'll heal the maimed. I'll bring home the homeless. In the very countries where they were hated, they will be venerated. On Judgment Day, I'll bring you back home, a great family gathering. You'll be famous and honored all over the world. You'll see it with your own eyes. All those painful partings turn into reunions, God's promise. You may not know this, but the only country in the history of the world that was a country at one point, then was no longer a country, and then became a country again, is the country of Israel. You can look back in your history book and you can see it in the late 1940s when Israel became Israel once again. It was something that was promised by God and it was something that God kept. God has one last promise left and that is to send Jesus back for each and every one of us. And He is coming at some point in some time. None of us know when, none of us can even predict when, no matter what some preachers will say. But there is a time that He's coming for you and He's coming for me. Make sure that you are resolved, that you know where you are with Him before that time comes because it can happen just like that. We'll see you next week.